Hey everyone, well, this little video is actually um, the homework a video chat session we had last evening. So, what I actually did uh, when writing the guitar profile uh, that I just posted uh, was to insert m the MIDI tracks of those licks into the Guitar Pro and have them uh, create the tabs uh, in that manner. And the positions that I've used last evening are no longer the same. You know how the licks should sound and you know what elements should be uh, of importance. So uh, relearn the licks in the new positions. It's actually the same notes but in different positions and try to record them against the backing track. Well, of course, I even changed the, uh, the tonality, so uh, I've moved everything uh, in the key of A major, so now we don't have the uh, key of B major, thus the uh, E Lydian progression, we have the D Lydian progression. So instead of those chords that we had last night, we have the same progression, but one whole step lower. So we have D major 7, we have uh, F sharp minor 7 and E major. Okay, so we have two bars of D major 7, then one bar of the uh, F minor 7, and one bar of E major. So, record these chords in any position that you want, and try to play the licks against these chords in any way you want. I want to see as many creative ideas as possible. You know how the licks should sound, so now you have the positions in the tabs in the guitar profile. So learn the licks and record them against the chord progression that I've been describing here now. All right? So until next week, I'd like to see as many interesting takes as possible. Okay? See you.